Welcome to Electron Online. Here we're going to do a second example of the mean value theorem. This time we're going to do it without graphing. So let's see if we can manage to figure this out. So again, the idea is that we have two endpoints. If we connect those two endpoints with a straight line, we get a slope. And the function, if we take the derivative of the function, we should be able to find the point where we get the exact same slope if we take the derivative. All right, let's try that. So we have a function right here. Let's take the derivative. And so the derivative would be f prime of x. And that is equal to 6x plus 2. So before I can now move further, I need to know what the slope is of the, of the straight line between the two points. And to do that, we have to find the corresponding y value of the endpoints. So I'm going to evaluate the original function at these two points to get the corresponding y values. So here we have f when x is equal to negative 1, that is equal to 3 times negative 1 squared plus 2 times negative 1 plus 5. Well, this would be equal to, that would be 1 times 3 is 3, minus 2 is 1, plus 5 is 6. We evaluate the function again, but now for x equals 1. So 3 times 1 squared plus 2 times 1 plus 5. So this would be 3 plus 2 is 4. 5 plus 5 is 10. All right. So those are the corresponding y values. So the two points on, this, on the graph for those particular values for x are as follows. We have the point negative 1, 6, and the point uh, 1 and 10. All right. So those are the two points. We know they're on the graph. We know when we connect them with a straight line, we should be able to figure out the slope. And the slope can be found by saying the slope is equal to the rise divided by the run, which is equal to the change in the y values divided by the change in the x values. And the change in the y values would be 10 minus 6, 10 minus 6, divided by 1 minus a minus 1, 1 minus a minus 1. So it would be 4 divided by 2, which is 2. So that's the slope between the two points on the graph. Okay, so what we need to do now is take our derivative and set it equal to the slope, which will allow, allow us then to find the x value that has the exact same slope when we have the derivative. All right, so set f prime of x equal to the slope that we found. So in other words, 6x plus 2 equals 2. That means 6x equals 0, which means x equals 0. So when x equals 0, we if we plug that value into derivative, we'll get the same slope that we got for the straight line. Let's try that. So now we're going to evaluate f prime when x is equal to 0 is equal to, here's the derivative, so it would be 6 times 0 plus 2, which is equal to 0 plus 2 or 2. And notice we get the exact same slope as we got over there. So that value between negative 1 and 1, which in this case is 0, gives us the exact same slope when we take the derivative as we get when we take the, the uh, slope of the straight line connecting the two points on the graph. And that is, in essence, the mean value theorem. And that's how we do that.